One hell of a ship you got here, Jimmy. How'd you get a hold of a floating palace like this? The Hyperion was Mink's flagship back in the day. Me and Matt decided to borrow her when we parted company with him. This old baby's seen us through some tight spots. Speaking of tight spots, Tychus, why are you still wearing that suit on my bridge? Yeah, what, you bust the zipper or something? Okay, so I might have had a little help when I broke out of prison. Let's just say it came at a price. I get to stay locked up in this suit till I pay off all my debts. And who's collecting those debts? Who sprung you? The Mobius boys, of course. I didn't just run into them in a museum, you know. They want them artifacts something fierce. Your debts better not bite us in the ass, Tychus. Covering for your shenanigans ain't part of the deal. Yeah, uh, sir, any chance you'll get the lab up and running soon? That'd be great. Just how bad is it, Matt? Zerger attacking all over the sector, sir. Manx pulled the fleet back to protect the Dominion core worlds, leaving the fringe worlds to fend for themselves. It's a nightmare. There's no way we can stop an alien invasion with one capital ship and a handful of volunteers. Best we just stay clear, partner. We can earn ourselves a fortune working for Mobius while this whole thing blows over. You don't get it, convict. This isn't gonna just blow over. The Zerg won't stop until we're all dead. Don't worry, Matt. We ain't sitting this one out. But we're not exactly in tip-top shape, either. We'll earn some cash and build up our forces so we can make a difference when it counts. Hey, everybody! Our glorious leader has returned! <laughs> hey, man, what's up, cowboy? What do you got for me, Swan? Uh, the usual. Building up our standard forces. Bringing my troops and hardware up to speed, huh? Yep. You can add upgrades for their tech right here on the console. But building an army on the run ain't cheap. You brought back credits this time, right? Look, I know money's been tight. But that artifact we just picked up from Marsar is gonna solve everything. Yeah, I've heard that before, brother. It's different this time. Yeah, I heard that one too. Upgrading what we got is all well and good, but when are we getting new hardware? A lot of gaps in our inventory right now. Sometimes we take a job with some kind of new hardware, and I get a schematic for it so we can make more of them. The plans for other stuff, we gotta either beg, borrow, or steal. What's our general status, Matt? We've picked up a distress call from the planet Agria. There's a colony there under attack by the Zerg. Your convict buddy Tychus lined up a mission retrieving another artifact. It's on a Protoss shrine world called Monolith. Any ship receiving this transmission? The Zerg are invading Agria. The Dominion abandoned us here. We're just a small farming colony. We've got to evacuate before we're overrun. If you can hear this message, please help us. The Mobius boys think there's another artifact on a world called Monolith. Supposedly, there's Protoss got it. A group of fanatics call themselves the Taldarim. Now, don't get all sentimental thinking these Taldarim are your old Protoss buddies. Because they ain't. Incoming transmission. Thank you so much for responding to our distress call, Commander. I'm Dr. Ariel Hansen, and I represent the people of the Agria Colony. Pleasure to meet you, Doc. You can call me Jim. What's the situation? The Zerg have overwhelmed our planetary defenses. The colony is lost. 
For the past 12 hours, we've been evacuating people to the nearest starport, but the Zerg attacks have become so intense, we can't get any more through. If you can guard the highway, we can start sending the remaining groups every few minutes. Don't worry, Doc. We'll get your folks through to that starport safe and sound. I pray you're right, Commander. The Zerg are more terrible than I ever imagined. You're here. I'll give you control of the main building so you can help us evacuate the colony. Fight fire with fire. Ready to roast. Fueled up. Barbecue time. SCV ready. What's going on? We'll need to escort the convoys all the way to the main starport for them to have a chance of escaping this planet. The first convoy from Lark's Crossing will be moving out soon. You got my attention. The doctor is in. Please state the nature of your medical emergency. Additional supply depots required. to defend the roads. Why are they empty? The Dominion military abandoned them when the Zerg attacked. They didn't give a damn about the colony. Sorry to hear that, Doc. At least these bunkers are in a good spot. I'll see if we can't get a man. Armed and ready. This better be one of these to me, boy. I'm Doctor is in. I feel you. 
It's a long haul to the starport, partner. How can we be expected to guard the whole thing? I reckon we can use a mobile force to keep it clear, or build more bunkers to block the approaches. Either way should work. Coming through. SCV ready. Must be an emergency. The next convoy is almost ready to go, Commander. Please alert your men. By the numbers. Go, go, go! That's fine. Keep your shirt on, Sparky. SCV ready. What's going on? All of them ready. Bad news? Roger. SCV ready. Got it. Who wants some? You got my attention. Fight fire with fire. This better be good. Get to the starport! Move it! You gonna give me orders? Sure. SCV ready. We hear you. By the numbers, ready to roast. SCV ready. I feel ya. Starport, move it! Orders received. Where does it hurt? You gonna give me order? By the numbers, boy. SCV ready. Armed and ready. You gonna give me orders? Sure. You 
Commander, another convoy will be heading out soon. Sure thing. Ready. Why not? This better be good. Looking forward to it. SCV ready. Go ahead. Oh, Bad news. Sir, we just detected Zerg organisms entering the upper atmosphere. 
I can't give you an exact fix, but they're heading your way. Who wants some? Arm, what's going on? In the rear with the gear. We have another convoy ready to be escorted, Commander. Been waiting on you. By the numbers, boys. I'm on it. We'll do. No, no, no. You got it. You gonna give me orders? Roger that. This better be good. By the number, who wants some? Armed and ready. You want a piece of me, boy? Of course. Big job, huh? In the light. Fight fire with fire. Everyone's here. Let's go. Fueled up. Gangway, coming through. 10-4. You gonna give me orders? Need a light. Been waiting on you. Go ahead. Go, go, go! Seismic disturbances closing in on your position. I think it's some kind of tunneling, Zerg. Wonderful. It's just like it. Keep things nice and interesting. That's a negatory. It's blocked. In the rear with the gear. Mineral field depleted. We're almost done, Commander. Another convoy will be starting out soon. In the rear with the gear. You gonna give me orders? Can't wait. Fight fire, fueled up. Ready to fry. What's going on? Mineral field depleted. Who wants some? By the numbers, boys. This better be good. You've been waiting on you. You got it. Outstanding. You gonna give me orders? Fight fire with fire. Is the road safe up ahead? The doctor is Guess in. we'll find out. 
Please state the nature of your medical emergency. They've been waiting on you. Of course. Bad news? I'm going. The doctor is in. Go ahead. You gonna give me orders? Great job, sir. Dr. Hansen's offered to stay on with us for now, and I think her skills will be invaluable. It's hard to believe I'm even here. Great to have you, Doc. How are you planning on pitching in? Well, your medical facilities are medieval, and your science expertise is non-existent. Perhaps I could start there? Ouch. Well, I guess you might be able to teach Stedman a thing or two. Welcome aboard, Doc. Guess you heard the news by now, Rainer. Looks like you're back in business. That I am, Mr. Hill. And fighting a Zerg and Dominion all at once is gonna take its toll on my standing forces. You got any guns for hire? But you know, the invasion makes it a seller's market right now. Still, your bartender over there makes a hell of a Mai Tai. So, sure, I've got some mercenary contracts you might be interested in. You're all heart, Mr. Hill. <laughs> 